Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel where we talk about money making and money saving tips. If you enjoy this video, please be sure to subscribe below and hit the thumbs up button. It helps out my channel so much with the YouTube algorithm and I truly appreciate it. Today, I'm gonna be showing you guys an apartment that costs $2,800 a month in US dollars. It's in Tel Aviv. It's super close to the beach and in a very central location. So let's go ahead and jump into it. So the rent on the apartment that I'm about to show you guys is 8,700 shekel per month. But in addition to that, the tenant is actually paying 680 shekel every quarter in what is like HOA fees. And then as well, they're paying 2,000 shekel per year for Arnona, which is like municipality property taxes. When you add all of that up in the aggregate over a year and then divide it monthly, the cost per month averaged out is 9,093 shekel and like 33 cents or something like that. And so if you convert that then to US dollars, you get about 2,800 US dollars per month. The apartment is in a very central and amazing location in Tel Aviv. It is near Arlozorov and Ibn Gabriel Street. It is a 20 minute walk to the closest beach to Shukha Carmel. It is a 20 minute walk to Rothschild Street and a 20 minute walk to um, Dizengoff. And then you can get to all of those places as well in a 10 minute car ride. So it is very central, amazing location. There's a lot of shops and cafes and restaurants all just around the corner. So it's an incredible location as far as that goes. This is the entranceway to the apartment. It is in a walk up building. There is no elevator. It's on like, I think the third or fourth floor. The layout is open concept where the entranceway leads right into the kitchen, which then leads right into the dining, living, spaces so we go straight into the kitchen which is an amazing like chef style kitchen it's got a big massive island right in the middle of it all this counter space lots of cabinet space everything stainless steel i am obsessed with this kitchen so beautiful from the kitchen we go straight to the dining area you can also see from the kitchen the all glass paneling windows that go all along the side of the living dining area which just lets in so much light. You can actually open up these windows and you get almost like a balcony feel from your living room and just can let all the cross ventilation breeze come through and almost make your indoor area a little bit of an outdoor area. You also can see all the greenery right outside the window even though she's living in Tel Aviv, which is fantastic. From here we go into the living room space which is also just like such a breath of fresh air, the color scheme that she's set up in this apartment. I'm thinking back on all those times When I feel close to from All that I could become Eager but too scared to climb Wanted to please my friends But it felt like the end from here, we go down the hallway, through back through the entranceway, we go straight into the bathroom. Now the bathroom is partitioned into two separate rooms and we have the area with the shower and the sink as well as the laundry. And then there's a separate room for the toilet. So you can have someone separately using the toilet while someone is showering or brushing their teeth or doing laundry or what have you. we go straight into what she is using as the master bedroom or you can call bedroom one it doesn't come with come with a closet but she did a really lovely job of putting in this gorgeous dresser the lovely detail on the handle i love the all black with the pop of gold and then as well on the hanging clothes it's all very well organized and you can see that the hangers themselves also have a pop of metallic so she's bringing in that metallic feel throughout a closet area which is really nice And then from here, you can either actually go from the balcony straight into the second bedroom, but let's go back inside and go into the second bedroom through the main area. And you will see here that this is the second bedroom. I believe this is also a queen size bed that's in here. Um, she did keep this space a little bit more minimalistic, is still designing it. Uh, this is her guest bedroom. <laughs> Being 
So essentially that is what you could say like 2800 US dollars can get you in a really central area of Tel Aviv. If you enjoyed this video, as always, please be sure to subscribe below and hit the thumbs up button. It helps out my channel so much with the YouTube algorithm. If you would like to know as soon as I post, when I post, you can also hit the bell notification down below and turn that all the way on. And feel free to leave some love in the comment section. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Catch you in the next one. This is who I am. This is, this is who I am.